This is a Rickinator appliance used to open the bite and bring the mandible slightly forward. If you have a skeletal class 2 by 2 to 3 millimeters, you can use a Rickinator to bring the mandible forward. There are a few things you need to know to activate the Rickinator. You need to send a bite to an ideal position. We will index the acrylic to the ideal finished position. As you place the bands, you see rests on the first bys. This helps prevent the premaxilla from moving forward. As the patient bites into the Rickinator, it has a tendency to bounce. The occlusal rest will stabilize the appliance from bouncing and moving the premaxilla forward and flaring the upper incisors. Also, as the patient wears the Rickinator, you may have to do some slight adjustment to keep the acrylic engaged with the tissue. You take the one jaw gingivally, two jaw occlusally, and squeeze. What this will do is re-engage the acrylic if it comes out of contact. And many times you may have to reline the anterior section as they wear the appliance. If you need to come any further forward, also you may have to trim the ramp if the ramp is too bulky for the appliant, for the patient, and or you may have to add acrylic to the ramp to keep the patient from biting behind the Rickinator. Also, you can add a gear to the Rickinator if you need more transverse expansion. Same principles apply. You just have a transverse gear which is turned like any other fixed appliance gear. Place the key in the hole, push distally, pull the key out till a new hole comes up, and you can develop transversely as well as open the bite and bring the mandible forward.